Welcome back to Must See Tech. Just like the rest of the automotive industry, camping vehicles are developing rather fast. New models with updated tech and smart solutions for outdoor vacations are introduced to the market each year. And in today's episode, we'll be exploring these newcomers and innovations that they have to offer. Get ready to see electric campers powered by solar power, portable caravans that expand to gigantic sizes, and smart homes on wheels that could be controlled via a smartphone. Subscribe to get notified about the new videos, and let's roll! IO Camper Designed by the Hungarian mechanical engineer Tomas Latsko for his own family, IO Camper has grown into an ambitious project with a goal to launch production in the beginning of 2019. The RV has patented design and is nothing like campers we're used to. Its folded version can be used as a functional motorhome, while it can fit into any L1H2 van, such as Fiat Ducato, Mercedes-Benz Sprinter or Volkswagen Crafter. In addition, the IO Camper can expand up to four times and serve as a standalone apartment that consists of two living rooms, a bedroom, a kitchen and a bathroom. It also has some smart home features, as most of its functions, including lights, temperature, air conditioning, fridge and battery levels, are controlled via a 23-inch infotainment system. Nissan Navara Dark Sky Concept Unveiled at the Hanover Motor Show in September 2018, this is a new mobile observatory concept that includes a rugged off-road-capable trailer and a Nissan Navara truck with enhanced front grille, restyled rear bumper and the most advanced pro-pilot driver assistance system. The concept was developed by Nissan in cooperation with the European Space Agency, aiming to allow astronomers carry out observations in distant dark sky locations. The trailer carries a mobile lab with an observatory-grade telescope powered by a battery pack from Nissan Leaf. In addition, the truck gets strengthened roof structure and specially developed thread-like units that do not interfere with the telescope. Death Left's Ryza Mobile Many campers who would like to switch to the zero-emission motorhome are eventually stopped by the range anxiety. However, the concept from Death Left's called eHome Rise Mobile is exploring the possibility to equip the Class C motorhome with plenty of solar panels, 334 square feet to be exact, that generate 3000 watt of power to recuperate the charge while off-grid. The vehicle is based on the Evaco Daily electric van with 107 horsepower electric motor and the range is limited to 103 miles with the equipped weight of the camper. Glad that you made it till here. Just wanted to let you know that we're steadily building up a playlist about vacation vehicles. Check it out after this video. The links will be in the information box in the end. Let's proceed. Nissan NV300 and ENV200 Camper Volkswagen and Mercedes have been rather unopposed on the market of compact camper vans with their California and Marco Polo models. However, Nissan is joining the race with the introduction of two factory-made configurations, based on the NV300 and ENV200 platforms, which are already quite popular among the conversion workshops. The former usually comes powered by a 1.6-liter DCI that is used on the X-Trail SUVs, and the latter is Nissan's quite successful electric fan with 107 horsepower electric motor and a 40 kWh battery 
good for 130 miles of range. The interior has stationary heating, stainless steel sink and a dining table. Plus, the customers can order individual upgrades directly at the dealerships. S Caravane. This is an innovative camping trailer that unfolds from a regularly sized caravan to a roomy apartment on wheels, and it is powered by wind and solar energy. The transformation can be done by one person in under 30 minutes, and the resulting home has a full-length patio deck, two bedrooms, a kitchen with a dining area that transforms into an additional sleeping space, and a bathroom with a compact washing machine and a separate toilet room. As Carabane is completely self-sustainable, it rotates 360 degrees to follow the sun, allowing its roof-mounted solar panels and wind turbine to generate 500 watt of energy each. Plus, it will get rainwater harvesting and filtration systems that are now under development. Grand California Available in two wheelbases, 22 and 19.7 feet in length, Grand California is the most recent addition to the family of Volkswagen commercial vehicles. The van is based on the VW Crafter that is packed with modern driver assistance features, has an optional all-wheel drive and the new infotainment system. The new Grand California comes equipped with a rear double bed and a skylight above, an optional front bunk bed for children swiveling front chairs and a complete kitchen with a pull-out 70-liter fridge. Another key aspect that differentiates this model is a bathroom that fits in a shower, a toilet, a wash basin, towel holders, a cupboard and several shelves. Other optional equipment include solar panels, a Wi-Fi hotspot and a satellite. E-Home Coco Developed as the first caravan that can be towed by an electric car, E-Home Coco is a compact trailer concept equipped with two 40kW electric motors and intelligent control electronics that reduce its towable weight to a predefined value, 220 pounds for example. This caravan is powered by a huge battery pack of 80kWh that can be recharged using regenerative braking or solar panels which are installed on the roof. Plus, its sun-charged battery can be connected to your home grid, acting as a backup power supply or an auxiliary power source that will reduce your electricity bills. Sprinter F-Cell Pursuing the emission-free future, Mercedes has added to their fleet a trio of hydrogen fuel cell vans. One of the newcomers is a Class C motorhome based on the platform of the best-selling Mercedes Sprinter. It is powered by a 197 horsepower electric motor that is fueled by a hydrogen fuel tank with 10 pounds of capacity ensuring 188 miles of range. Moreover, an additional tank could be placed in the back to extend the distance traveled to 312 miles. Unfortunately, for now we do not get a chance to look inside of the Sprinter F-Cell motorhome, but judging by the Mercedes' successful Marco Polo campers, this model should also live up to the Mercedes name.
you made it till the end, the camper community salutes you. Let us know what you think about the camping innovations that you saw in this video. Do you greet them with open hands or would you rather oppose the progress and stick to the traditional bare minimum camping? Check out the vacation vehicles playlist listed on the screen, subscribe to our channel and like this video. See you soon!